right, I'm trying. Okay, all right. Who is it? It's Chen. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Chen? Well, you had to live on the second floor, didn't you? <laughs> well, you're gonna invite me in, or so I just catch pneumonia. Sorry, it's just that, uh, well, you're not exactly what I expected. What were you looking for, a date? I'm sorry, it's not that kind of service. No, actually, I, I was looking for someone a little more, uh, Chinese. Like, because my name is Chen? Well, yeah. Would you go to a spiritual healer named Shulman? Probably not. Well, there you go. Now, what seems to be the problem? Well, I don't normally stand like this. Well, don't stand like that. I'm kidding. Would you have a seat? What, what, what are you doing? You want an estimate, don't you? Oh, oh, oh. What, what? You had a uh, an emotional trauma recently a blow to your system something that sent you reeling I, did you talk to todd today no just to my mother in florida well jen like what i really need is a massage okay so while i am sure that you work wonders with teddy roosevelt what i need is somebody a little um younger well, and stronger oh oh, oh. You're hired. Well, at least he didn't cry like Roosevelt. <laughs> Rough ride on my ass. It's helping. Good, and by the way, thanks for bringing up the table. Uh, no problem. You know, lifting it actually moved some of the pain to my good side. Now, you're sure this discomfort doesn't come from any emotional place? I'm positive. Will you stop asking me that? Okay. You see, there's an ancient Chinese proverb that says, a barrel of fish does not float upstream on its own. That makes absolutely no sense. Well, it loses a little in the translation from the Yiddish. <laughs> the basic thing is that you alone have the capacity to relieve your pain, but you must be willing to let it go. Well, I'm not holding on to anything. Of course you're not. Ow! Oh! Oh! But uh, if you were, uh -huh. if you were, here is a very special exercise that was given to me by my master, Lao Ling. Real name? Uh, Murray Blitzenberg. <laughs> what it is is that you get a box, and in the box, you put all the items and gifts that remind you of whoever's causing the pain. Then you close the box and you... Throw it away. Well, the only thing that Jack ever gave me is that stupid boxing nun over there. Oh, the problem has a name, huh? Let's see. It's adorable. <laughs> Get rid of it. Well, I don't know, Chen. I mean, the whole thing sounds kind of silly. Telling what's silly is you're holding on to your pain. Now, I'm telling you, the nun goes. And it's a shame that he didn't give you the dresser. It's a monstrosity. 